Adebayo community in Ovia South local government area of Edo State is the latest beneficiary of government's power expansion initiatives in rural communities. This follows the inauguration of a 100 kilowatt solar hybrid panel built by the Rural Electrification Agency in that community. Dennis Temple reports that the community is hopeful that the coming of electricity to their locality will address post-harvest losses and improve their economic status. Predominantly agrarian community, the people say they have suffered post-harvest losses over the years due to lack of electricity for preservation of crop yields. They are optimistic that with the coming of light, their economic fortune will improve. The comparison is wide. The difference is clear. So we are enjoying the light. The business is the good is much small. Thank God. If I were away. This, the federal government said, is another effort to bridge the gap in the energy sector. He has told us, if he didn't come in there, that already they have, they have uh, wire supplied to 500 homes. There's it's a room, provision for another 200 homes. So that's, that's exp expansion. If we, com if we consume all of that and there's need for extra, and we've made one, why not? Another, another one, there's been an extension of that program. But first, let's satisfy and utilize, maximize what we have, which is what they are doing. For now, it's not maximized yet. There's provision for maintenance from the bills they pay. So I'm very sure they are going to get 24 hours electricity. For us, anywhere we believe that there is a, there's a high investment, so the issue of security there is paramount. So for us, we'll protect it so that the people so I begin to see how we can make our rural becoming gravitating towards urban. The Rural Electrification Agency and the development partners said the project they have embarked upon demonstrates federal government's resolve to improve energy infrastructure across Nigeria, urging the beneficiary to utilize the opportunity to improve their economy. We are moving one community at a time. So we are moving along, we are making progress, uh, and as the Honorable Minister of State mentioned, you know, we are able to now see how we can take this uh, sort of initiative to other uh, neighboring communities as well. Solar hybrid mini grids such as this would provide greener option for rural electrification. In Adebayo community in Novia South, local government area of Ido State, Dennis Temple, NTN News.